The Bruin boys soccer team is well underway and are six games into the 2023-2024 season. After last week's big home win against East Rankin Academy, the team's record stands at 2-1-2. and While the team won't repeat its undefeated regular season record of last year, players are positive they can still end strong. So the season's been going pretty good. We started off, we were missing some guys. Uh, but as we've been going along, we've been playing more like a complete team. And uh, we've got all our guys back, and we had a convincing win tonight, 5-0. And, uh, yeah, we're going into next week. We have Heritage at home. And then district play starts after Christmas break. So we're pretty excited and just ready to go. Last year, the boys defeated every team in district and non-district games. The only loss, Pillow Academy in the state championship game. And that came in a penalty kick shootout that broke a tied game. The boys lost three key seniors from last year's team. But Danielle Poe, the assistant coach for the boys team, says this year will still be strong. So these seniors this year, they've been doing a pretty good job at leading this team. They're the goal is to get back to state for everybody, but especially for them, this being their final season with us. And um, we had a rocky start, but the boys have been putting in the work, and we're excited to see where we're going. Following the Heritage Academy game, the boys will take a break over the Christmas holidays. Their next game, Tuesday, January 9th, is at Hartfield Academy. The Hartfield game is the opening game of district play. They're first since moving up to the 6A classification. Other big district games include Jackson Prep and Jackson Academy. This year's team is led by such seniors as Franklin Hampton, Parker Davis, Reese Chandler, Andrew Doherty, Stone Putnam, Cy Steven, and Braylon Poindexter. Another senior, Fritz Barber, who has been out with an injury, returned to the field last week. Uh, so in uh, April, I had a bad hip injury and I had to get surgery uh, in July. Um, and so this is my first game back today and it went well. We won. The boys played good. Colby had a lot of good goals, so yeah. The key to this year and the transition to 6A is hard play, confidence, and strong senior leadership. Qualities the players and coaches say they certainly have. The boys soccer team is coming together this year. Signing off, I'm Charlie Gordon.